Guys, long time ago, I uploaded a video on Ben Letter, which uh, many of you liked a lot. So I thought, why not make another detailed video on Ben Letter as well, covering everything from great detail, from basic setting to game installation. So if you also want to install it too, then watch the video completely, and uh, you will be able to install it just a few minutes. So without any further ado, let's get started. First, you need to download this uh, APK file, and uh, after downloading it, simply install it. You can find a download link of the simulator on my website from where you can easily download it. So now it has been successfully installed and uh, you just need to launch it. When you launch it for the first time, uh, it will install some additional files. So let it complete the installation. One eternity later. Guys, the installation is now complete and you just need to click on the plus icon. And now you should make the exact same settings that I'm doing. Otherwise, you might face error during gaming. First, you need to set the resolution to 720p. And uh, after that, select uh, version 9.3 in the Wine section. Below, you will see a turnip version, uh, which you need to set to universal. Next, scroll down and uh, select GeForce under GPU, and then allocate 4 GB of video memory. Now, go to the Advanced App section and uh, select Performance in both of these options. So we have completed almost all the settings, and now let's uh, save it. After saving it, click on these three dots and choose the Run option. Then your Windows will start launching. So guys, Windows has been successfully launched and you can see how smoothly it is running. And after launching it for the first time, you need to install DirectX first. For that, just go to the start menu and then to the install section. There you will find DirectX at the bottom, just launch it. As soon as you launch it, the installation will start and it will take around 5 to 6 minutes to complete. One hour later. So now we have completed almost all the steps and installed DirectX as well. And let's go ahead and install a game. To install it, you need to download uh, any PC game you like and then place it in the download folder of your Android device. Then you can easily access this folder from the D drive in my computer. Additionally, you can easily activate key mapping as well. Just uh, go back and select this option and uh, your key mapping will be activated. In some games, you will get uh, auto configured key mapping, meaning as soon as you launch the game, your key mapping will be activated. So here I will test GTY City and I have already placed uh, its uh, setup in the D drive and let's quickly install it. The installation is now complete and let's uh, launch it and see how much FPS we get. As you can see, the game is launched and it is working perfectly and I'm getting around 25 to 30 FPS. Additionally, the key mapping is also working quite well. Furthermore, I tried some other games on this emulator as well. And in most of them, I was getting black screen issue or the emulator was crashing during loading. So guys, we have reached at the end of the video and I hope uh, you have find it very helpful. I have covered everything in a great detail so that you don't face any problem. Additionally, I have made uh, another video on this emulator as well, which you can check it out by clicking on the right video. And I will see you there. Bye.